Hey guys, it's Miklio. Welcome back to more Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild Master Mode. In the last episode, we lit Robbie's Furnace, we upgraded some equipment, and we got a memory. And in this episode, uh, I'm going to Hyrule Castle and doing my best. Uh, thank you for remembering to remind me, you, who I told you to at the end of the last episode. Thank you. I'm not going to draw this joke out again. Anyway, let's go! Alright, we arrive at the shrine, and now we must sneak into Hyrule Castle. I'm not going through the front gate. Um, I forget exactly where, but there is an entrance to the bottom of it. And we are looking for three things... Oh, hey, a Korok. I'll grab that in a second. Uh, we're looking for three things in particular. The Royal Recipe, which I do remember where that is. Uh, the Royal Guard's Gear, which we can just find anywhere. Just any uh, Royal Guard equipment. Um, there's swords sh and shields. and I don't remember if there's a spear. I think it's just swords and shields, but I'm not sure. And the Royal Guard... Um, armor, which is in the dining hall, the guard's chamber, and on the second floor. Uh, where would the Korok be? If I had to guess, it would be at the top of this. Uh, yeah. Let's, uh, put on our climbing gear. I don't think we need it, but may as well get that extra boost. Is it at the top? Uh, it's not looking like it. It would be that balloon. That was a weird jump, but that's okay, because we hit the Korok. <laughs> Alright. Uh, well, we're alive. Uh, kind of, so let's just get our normal, our normal armor back on. Get out of here, slimes. There we go. Alright. Let's make our way even further to this castle. I think... Well, I know that one of the entrances is in the moat. Um, it's just a matter of where in the moat. Alright, Guardian, let's do this. Hey, I see a chest. What? Well, that, that didn't happen. Don't worry about it. Um, let's put our helmet on. I know you, like, parry just after seeing... There we go! That's the timing. That was way, way too early. That is not the timing. Alright, well, one out of three is pretty bad. Uh, I'll get used to it again, eventually. Uh, it's just not that time yet. Uh, well, let's, uh, let's get these treasure chests, shall we? Let's see what's inside. What is in treasure chest number one? A hundred rupees? Not a bad haul. Not bad haul at all. What about this one underneath the... the slab? I don't want to move the slab if I don't gotta. I just want to, like, reach in. There we go. Drop the chest on your head. Very important. I needed to unlock it, right? Let's just break the lock on top of my thick skull. Um, anyway. <laughs> We're getting close to the moat. We should be able to spy our entrance very shortly. I should probably equip my Xenoblade armor for that. Not the helmet just yet, just in case we uh, see a Korok along the way. Um, you do not want to get spotted by that. No, thank you. Uh, is that it? That might not be it, but that is a landing. Oh yeah, that's that's definitely one of them. There are more than one, I think, but this is definitely one. Am I going to get contacted by Zelda? I believe so.
That's a big boy. Uh, we have a sledgehammer, right? Yeah. Alright, I guess I don't need uh, the uh, swimming gear for this entrance. Uh, oh, these are our luminous. Alright, let's get our luminous stones and our flint. Oh, hey, a cooking pot. I should use this. Um, I don't have a torch anymore, right? No, I have that meteor up, but I'm not going to waste that. There we go. Once I'm done cooking, I'm just going to let this music play for a while, because this is, this is a good song. Also, Master Sword, double-powered while you're here. Very useful. Alright, I made a couple things. Not a lot, but it should be enough to tide us over for now. So, now I'm just going to let this music play for just a little bit. I really love this song, it's so good. It's really nice. And of course now it's getting ruined by this minecart screeching, but that's alright. Uh, and I believe there is... Do I have my Sheikah sensor on? Guess... I guess it just doesn't work in Hyrule Castle. Uh, but the reason I'm asking is because there is a shrine here, as well as a Korok, as you might hear. Uh, the request for this one is... Why did I spin around? Uh, is for boiled eggs, which we can just drop a bird egg into this hot water, and it will... It will boil on its own. You're in a dangerous place, uh, Korok. So, um, you might want to get out of here before Ganon just devours your soul. Oh, maybe the shrine isn't in this room. I know there is, like, a shrine in underground Hyrule Castle. I just... I thought it was there, but I guess it's not. But now, after we break through the wall, we are in the dungeons! Alright. It's a bit of a maze. Oh, hey, another Korok. We'll grab that soon. Alright. Oh, there's a chest there. Definitely want that. Can break through this wall. Uh, does this constitute breakable? Like, it's cracked, but... Yeah, I didn't think so. It's not cracked enough. Oh, man. Alright, we're gonna want to... Destroy that. That only... Yeah, that lever there opens things up, but it also lets the enemies out, so I'm like... Excuse me? Don't you guys want out too? Alright. Now we have a 60 power Master Sword against these guys. And Durg's protection, which is nice, so I can focus on one of them. Except it's gone now, but let's let's take care of this guy. Do I have a a silver moblin? Yes, I do. Okay. All right. When are you gonna attack? You caught it on fire. That is terrifying. 
Do not want that today, no sir. And as you're getting low on health, now you fall down and you get set on fire in death. I'm so sorry. Um, ooh, there's a frost rod in there. Or a blizzard rod, excuse me. Uh, I do actually kind of want to save my Master Sword's power uh, for a certain fight, so I am going to switch it off. Uh, I do need some damage given the enemies in here, so I'll do the spear for now. Oh, hey, Purple Rupee. It's so weird to see, like, rupees on the ground now, because, like, you're s I'm so used to most of my rupees just coming from chests and selling, and, like, you don't see many drops in Breath of the Wild anymore like that. It's kind of sad. Anyway, we have our Topaz. Oh! This is the fight I was talking about, so we can get our Master Sword back. Uh, we're going to want to equip our good armor for this, uh, and our camera. Stalnox. Yep. Alright. Uh, it doesn't really matter what rune I have. Doors locked behind us. We must fight this thing. Alright. Like most Tinoxes, you want to aim for the eye. Um... You can do damage to this part of it, but you cannot kill it with damage to the skeleton. You must kill its eye. Uh, and its eye will fall out after you do enough damage, like so. So now I'm just gonna beat on it with my Master Sword. And it's almost dead. Do I have anything that does over 40 damage? No, so I'm going to want a quick weapon and just zap it like that. Uh, that went a lot easier than I expected it to. I thought I was going to have some trouble with that. But no, we, we did it very well. Nice. Oh, I'm getting rid of the Boko Club. But yeah, let's read this. Strike down the giant foe to become recognized as a knight of the kingdom. Do we have space in our shields? Yes, we do. And for that, we get the best shield in the game. The Hylian Shield. Uh, the Hylian Shield has an absurd amount of durability. Um, depending on when in the game you get it, you are not likely to break it. Uh, like, it takes a while. Like, even against Guardian Shots, which tend to destroy shields instantly, still takes a while. Um... Of course, because it's such a good shield, you know, the whole I'm gonna save it for when I need it thing. Um, because, as I said, it can break. You can get it back if it does. Um, but not yet, I don't think. Royal Broadswords, nice. Uh, let's get rid of one more thing. The Royal Broadsword, it tends to be my weapon of choice when the Master Sword is... Gone. What do I want to get rid of? Um. I guess the small thunder blade. No. Let's get rid of the guardian spear. It's probably going to break soon anyway. Because I believe I've used it before here as well. Alright, our this isn't the Royal Guard's gear we're looking for, so we still need to find uh, different weapons. Uh, but yes, I'm, I'm glad we got the, the Hylian shield. The iconic shield of this series. Let's open this up, because... Never mind, it's not that switch, it's this one right in the middle, of course. Never mind, it's broken, how do I get in? Oh, through the other side, because this opens... Let's let one of them out, because I only want to fight one of these guys at once. Doesn't do much damage to me, but... I still should be fighting better than that. There we go. This is what we need. Oh, jeez. 
I didn't even have a chance to respond to that one, but this one I did! This one, he gets another flurry rush! Uh, it's on fire! That's okay, he's going down! Good night! Oh hey, this opened on its own again. Alright. This guy's facing me, so sneaking up on him won't do anything. He did more damage than the the Moblin. Also, I'm going to put this on again, because I'm not... I'm not too worried about dying. I'm just... But I'm also not quite sure where all the Koroks are. We have never seen these weapons before, which means it is a... Uh, it's Prime... Uh, what was the... It was the shield, right? Yeah. It's prime picture time! Nice. I s do I? That's an electric Lizalfa, so it doesn't matter. Because I don't know if I have the, the silver... Uh... Lizalfos. I know I have the Moblins for sure now, which I'll probably end up forgetting. Um... There's a chest, like, guarded by him, right? Yeah. Uh, uh, get up, Link! Get up, Link! I do not want you to use your electric moves and make me drop my equipment. Thank you! Let's open this chest! Silver rupee, nice, nice. Rupees are always welcome. Ooh, well, let's... <laughs> Just picked it up on instinct. Now we we gotta take a picture of it because we haven't grabbed one of these before, so obviously we do not have a picture. There we go. Um I believe there's like meant to be a way around this or something. Oh, there's like an eye right in there. Does this get rid of this too? Or just in there? Yes, nice! Nice shot! And yet, you can sneak into the dungeon this way, provided it's not raining. Uh, which it is, so good luck. Uh, anything in here? N nope. Alright, Cryonis. Cryonis is always the, the rune I forget exists the most. Ooh, big hearty truffles. Nice. That's good stuff. Where is this Korok? I do not want to miss it. This leads us outside, huh? Hmm, it might be above us. I will take care of this guardian, find the Korok seed, and then duck back into the caverns to find the- to go the other way we didn't. I can take one shot from this guy. Oh, never mind, Daruk's protection is back. But let's get this timing down. That's not the timing. And it killed him, so never mind. <laughs> I'll get it one day. I swear. Yeah, but... Oh, is that it? That's like a lone rock. That might be it. Or it might be a different one. I think that's the case. That's fine. That just means we get... Another Korok seed that we weren't otherwise expecting. <laughs> I did indeed find you. And you know what you found? A headache. Because I'm that kind of jerk. Does coming coming back here reactivate the Korok? Yes, it does. And it's probably above us. It might be in that, like... I don't know what to call this. I'll just call it a wall. The Great Wall of Hyrule Castle. I don't know. It's probably up here. Yes, it is. Bow and arrow. I don't have enough arrows for these. Okay, just come back down there. And you're the easy one. You're the slow one. Right there. And then where are you? Wait for you to come back down now. Okay! We got it. We got it. Alright, let's... Let's duck back into the caverns to go through the other path, because... 
Uh, for one, I believe the Royal Guard's equipment is easier to find indoors, and two, it's a way to stay indoors and like find the recipe, find the Royal Guard armor. I just want to explore Hyrule Castle's interior for this stuff. The exterior doesn't hold much interesting right now, mostly just mostly just some Koroks. Uh, a memory, which I'll I'll probably get while I'm here. Um and then some Lionels, which I do not want to face. And of course, a metric ton of guardians. Alright, uh, there's another Korok in here. Yep, I remember now. Let's just throw this weapon at this guy and get it over with. It's not going to be doing much damage for us in the long run. Frozen. Uh, sure. Let's use this weapon. Our royal broadsword. Oh yeah, there is a royal guard spear. He's using it. Nice. Alright, so royal guard equipment is powerful. Uh, it's very good equipment to use. Uh, but the drawback is that it's extremely fragile. It will break quickly quickly if you're actively using it it's like the epitome of save this until you need it sort of equipment uh where did it go oh it's like it went back here it's dark so i couldn't see it so and of course i don't want to i want to keep at least one unbroken because we need it for that one quest should I just break my royal broadsword on some boxes? <laughs> I'm a fool. Um. Okay, so now we want to rise, and the Korok's probably on like one of these platforms or something. We'll figure it out. We'll just take this slowly. I don't feel like changing clothes right now. <laughs> yeah, this would be the Korok. How did just how did, like, a normally shaped rock get in here, though? Like, I know there's, like, rock bricks all around us, but, like, that's, like, a natural rock. Uh, there's a door over there. I believe that's the only other exit to this room. Right. <laughs> Let's walk on this way. But I do want to look around just a little bit more to make sure. Can I make it over that lip? No. Wait, we can walk on this? I am Link, the hero of Hyrule. <laughs> All right. I should be using other stuff other than my weapons to break this, but alas, I'm a fool. Uh, this room extends even higher up, huh? Oh yeah, no, there's, there's another exit to this room above us. I don't think this is an exit to the room at all, actually. There's probably just like an enemy and crap to grab in here. Nope, there's a abominable wall. Uh, what does this do? Oh, nice! I don't think I ever found that before. Uh, that makes things so much easier. Also, what room is this? That's not what I'm trying to do. Uh, I just gotta be sure. I don't know what this room would be. Um, dining hall, guards chamber. Oh, yeah, this isn't a guards chamber at all. And it's definitely not the dining hall. <laughs> Hello? Okay. Whatever, I guess. Why wasn't it attacking me? I'm so confused. I'm not complaining, because that gives me ample time to do this crap to it. <laughs> I'm just confused. Uh, I can't pick up any more shields, huh? Well, let's get rid of one of my weak shields. I just picked it back up. Because I want the good shield... There we go. And what would be in our chest? Oh, a shard... Shard of Dinrail's Fang. 
Okay, that's nice. I do need his scale, though, not his fang. So before I go to the Shrine of Power, this is a ladder uh, that I have in my quest list, I do want to get one of his shards. So I'll have to, like, farm him. Well, it's not really farm if you're only getting one material from him, but I'll have to, like, wait for him uh, at one of the death mountain places, because I do know a good one for him. Another exit! Except, of course, we are going through, and let's re-equip our very handy Master Sword, because 60 damage for a one-handed weapon. That's absurdly great. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Okay. Oh, there's one of those, those guys. I'm running out of arrows, which is why I waste them from long-distance shots, where I can't tell the distance exactly <laughs> there's another one here huh okay let's go get our arrow back shall we there it is nice Shh. you don't see me you don't wow you actually the sneak strike didn't trigger even though the thing was on. I'm sad. That's okay. He's... Okay. A no extra damage sneak strike then. You think your shield can block the master sword? You fool. There we go. Let's, uh... Let's get our newly... Uh, identified Korok Seed, depending on where it is. If it's above us, there's nothing I can do. Uh, might be below us, I doubt it. Uses the Master Sword to smash crates. Is this the... This is the Guard's Chamber, so there's gonna be something in here. Nice. Uh, I'm probably not gonna be able to get a Sneak Strike on them, considering they're facing each other. Let's see, will the explosions reach them? Yes, it will. Gotta attack this guy first, because he's the lower on health. Excuse me, don't shoot your water at me. Phrasing, I guess. Ooh, ouch. That did do a fair amount of damage, and I'm not sure if I have fairies or not. Yeah, I have four, I'm fine. <laughs> Never mind. I was about to say, I don't know if I have fairies or not, so I don't want to be risky, but I have a bunch, so I'm fine. I still don't want to lose them, if possible, but I'm not worried about a game over, is the point I'm trying to make. Also, there's that X chest, I think. Yes! Nice! Which piece of the, of the Royal Guard armor is in this? The boots. Alright. The least interesting piece in terms of aesthetic. But that's okay. Ooh, a Royal Guard's Claymore. I do not want to get hit by that. I am going to play safe with this guy. Oh, well now I have Daruk's protection, so I have nothing to worry about. Let's just go in swinging then. Well, if he's not even gonna hit me properly in general, then what the hell? Alright, what am I getting rid of for this? Uh, the Knight's Claymore, obviously. It's breaking. Oh, I should have taken a picture, because I probably... Wait, it didn't give me the, the like, thing, so yeah, maybe I have seen one of these before. <laughs> a rusty Claymore. A royal Claymore and a rusty shield. Uh, if I would, like, de-rust those, they would probably turn into good weapons, but I don't got the patience. Alright, let's continue our quest. Is there, like, an exit up there or something that I can go to, or is it just another part of the room? Do -do -do. Looks like it's just another part of the room, but there is a bow... A falcon bow and some chests. And is that a rusty axe? A rusty halberd? Sure is. 
Ooh, bomb arrows. Nice, nice. Uh, well, I want one. Oh, actually, no. Most of my bows are about as good, because it's the same as this, uh, but this has two shot, this has three shot, so I want to keep those. All right, let's backtrack and see if we can't find this damn Korok seed. There's some weapons down there. Actually, I think I might not have the halberd. Of course I do. <laughs> I'm at the point where I have most things, but don't think I do. The Korok seed is definitely under this. Let's just... Oh, this is walkthroughable? I wanted to set it on fire. Never mind, the Korok seed is definitely not under this. Just a chest with a Nadra fang. Nice. That's neat. Uh, Alright, well, I guess... Well, this is bombable. Just another chest, no Korok... Oh, yep, there's the Korok seed right there. Yaha! Yaha! Ancient arrows! Not complaining about that. Take what? Oh, my arrow back? Yes. Absolutely. Thank you. Um, we still haven't found the library. Uh, which way did I come from? That way. Because <laughs> the weapons are lying around. Alright. Well, obviously, there's something through there, but given that it is covered in malice, calamity, we can't get through there. Uh, so we're probably going to have to enter from a different area. But that's fine. Okay, well, we've pretty much cleared that half of the Hyrule interior, so let's find another entrance, shall we? Um, yeah, whatever. I thought I had a one-handed weapon equipped. That's okay. Daruk saved my butt. Thanks, man. You're a pal. Daruk's protection... It's ready to go. <laughs> Ooh, another Korok, huh? Uh... I don't want to deal with that right now, thanks. Even though I have one more Daruk's protection remaining, I just want to climb up here and get into the next entrance. Well, I'll get one of you. No, I, no, no, I won't. Where? Royal Bow! Arrows, nice. Where, um... Oh, nice, more ancient arrows. Where did the balloons appear? Are they above? Are they... Do I have to stand on the ledge for them to appear? Oh, well, that's great. Well, I guess I gotta do something about these guardians. I would like to only have to tackle one at a time, though, if that's agreeable with you, game. Let's see if I can get it at this distance. No! Well, <clears throat> looks like I'm doing this the walk up and beat the crap out of it way. I can climb on dead guardians. Uh. Oh, I thought I had it that time, too. Dang it, I had enough timing as to where it didn't stagger me, but I didn't have it perfectly. Uh, let's just eat the hard-boiled eggs. Get out of the fire. I do want to get this timing down. Damn it, I keep going way too early. <sighs> I used to be so good at this! Ah. It just takes practice. 
There we go. That's the timing. I just gotta do that. <laughs> I just gotta keep doing that. Oh, it's standing on top of Malice, so I just jump up here and take a bunch of damage, huh? Fantastic. All right. Oh, more Malice. Why do you gotta be sitting on Malice? Nope, don't think so. I'm just gonna walk away. This is also gonna be on top of Malice, right? Yeah, I'm not jumping in there for my materials. I just wanted these things out of the way so I could get my damn Korok. Alright, let's climb back up and actually figure out where the balloons appear this time. I'm gonna run out of stamina, but that's okay, because I made it. Okay. Uh, actually, judging by the fan... Where... If I climb up here, maybe? I doubt it. No. Oh, I might have to shoot this, considering other people have shot it. Then what's the fan for? No, there's another one here. I know there is. I remember it. It's just... What the heck? I just wasn't looking in the distance far enough. It's like way out there. I just have to aim properly. Uh, and adjusting your aim is great when your bow breaks and you have limited supplies of arrows. Uh, damn it. Got it! Alright, so... I'm just dumb and wasn't looking into the distance far enough. Okay, I can accept that. Alright, looking at this rotation map, we are near another entrance. It's just gotta take some gliding. And more Korok finding! I'm never free, I guess. It might be inside, or it might be up this cliff. Or it might be this way. It might be down this cliff. I think it's down this cliff. I think it's in this rock pile. Yeah. You're never free from the Korok search. Never. There you go. Alright, now we just gotta climb upwards and naturally get interrupted by another Korok, I'm sure. Let's stop being dumb. Where's my climbing gear? There we go. No, I want the pants too, because I want the... the, the this boost. Now wait till they're just near the top and use the last of our stamina. Perfect. Okay. Hey, buddy. You're just gonna ignore me, right? Yeah. 
because the entrance is just above us, provided this isn't also covered by, like, a gate or calamity or something. Uh, it doesn't look like it is. But I, uh, yeah, no, it's open. We're good. Is this the dining hall? Sure is. And the dining hall is terrifying, but there's a piece of armor in here, so we gotta get it. Also, there's... There's good, good cooking ingredients, too. So... Oh, and they're silver, too, so, like... We want their gemstones. Mulduguffin! Ooh. Can I get a sneak attack? Of course not. He has a Zora Spear. We haven't seen... Have we seen one of those yet? I don't remember. We might have. We'll know in a second once this guy's dead. I'm just gonna face tank these. Ah! Well, now you're regenerating and that's no fun. Fall down! Oh yeah, we've seen silver scale spears before. Alright, well this will be easier because we're only fighting one at once. Let's, let's eat something. And let's equip my helmet. Uh, I can't believe that didn't hit me, considering I dodged, like, right into it, but I, uh, I'm not gonna complain. Alright, let's check over here. Is our chest in this direction? No, but there's a royal... Is that a halberd? No, it's just a normal spear. There's a royal guard spear in the fireplace. So metal, metal's good firewood, right? Yeah. All right, let's uh, steal these ingredients. Do, 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 do. We've been spotted. Ah! All right, yeah. I, uh, you know what? I have nine of these. I... Oh, wait, that would have eaten his gemstones, though. I'm an idiot. <laughs> I just really didn't want to deal with two at once, but I didn't think about the consequences. That's okay, that one swings above us, so... No damage there. Get your stone smasher. You don't even drop me a bunch of... A bunch of gems to compensate for my idiocy. Alright, where is... It did say the dining hall, right? I'm not making stuff up. Hidden near the dining hall. Okay, so not inside. So we just killed these guys for the ingredients and the gemstones. Okay. Um, Which way do we want to go first? I'm going to go this way first. So I can... Uh hopefully shoot down the Calamity and, like, connect the two areas, if that makes sense. And also fight another one of these guys. And... Yep. Alright, well, whatever. Jeez, I... Uh, 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 yeah! That'll do. Come on! I had my shield up. Yeah, yeah. This is your your down smash that won't hit me. Okay, I'm surprised the Master Sword is lasting this long. I really thought it would have lost charge by now. Um, is this one just not connectable, or did I miss the thing on the other side? Can I hit that from here? Did I... Yes, that was a good arc. I'm just not gonna get hit by you, I've decided. Uh, now that I've said that, I totally will. Um, yeah, right there. I have two more fairies, it's fine. I can be a fool and reckless. 
I'm allowed. This is my game. If I want to play like an idiot, I can. Nice. Gotcha. Also, Koroxine, huh? We don't have a space for that? Right, because we've been using the Master Sword the entire time. Ah, yes, the legendary Master Thunderblade. Hey, guys. I can't believe there's still, like, another Korok seed in the area. Uh, if it's probably above us, if I'm being real. I'll take a quick once over this room, just to be sure. If it's above us, I don't care. Not yet. As I've established, I'm only doing the interior of Hyrule right now. You know what? You know what? I'm lying. Uh, I'm going to go get that. Um, this, this is a bit earlier than I'd cut it, but we are running close on time. So I'm going to get this Korok Seed, uh, and then we'll do the other part, the other half of Hyrule. Uh, it's raining? We'll do the other half of Hyrule soon. Um, do I have any food that's good for healing, or is it all like buffs? I think it's all like buffs. This is my best one, and it's an attack up. Uh, well, we'll do this, I guess. I don't really feel like just eating a billion apples at this point. Two, three, four, five. Slide one two three four five. Slide one two. I lost count, so I'm just gonna slide now and get it over with. One two three four five. One two three four five. Uh, please. Oh, we can stand here. Bless Hylia. Okay, we are up. Let's equip our regular gear now and find that Korok seed. It's probably, like, right here. Yeah. Another bow and arrow, huh? Come on, show yourself. Thank you. Oh, really? That should have hit. Whatever, we'll get it while it's staying still, and we'll get this other one as it comes up and then starts to stay still. Oh, unless it just... They didn't switch places. They just... Okay. Alright, well, once it crosses, and then it'll cross back. Got it! But, yeah! On that note, it's a bit early, but I will end this off here. Uh, and in the next episode, we will take on the other half of Hyrule Castle's interior. So, thank you so very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I will see you next time. Also, you can't see it, but I'm doing like very exaggerated body body gestures so have fun imagining that <laughs> see ya